What we do today? Um, go to bed for body work, step 37 candles. Hey, don't tell them 37. <laughs>here today at Bath and Body Works. It's candle day. I got my coupons ready and there's quite a bit of cars here so I'm kind of nervous that it's going to be pretty busy but it doesn't look so inside like from what I can see. So hopefully not. So my math was all wrong in my head. They have these crates and each crate is, um, it can hold six candles and I was thinking in my head, okay, well I, I went in thinking I'm going to get 30 candles. I wanted to get 30. I don't know why that was the lucky number, but that was what it was. So I went in and I was like, the guy asked how many crates I need. Okay, I'll need six. No. Six times six is 36, so I um, went over my candle limit by six. And then I was, um, was trying to figure out, okay, well, let me get rid of an entire crate of candles. And none of my scents were repeated, so all my scents were different. I couldn't choose, so I ended up getting 36 candles. And then I get to the desk. And they had another candle up there, and I smelled it, and so I ended up getting 37 candles. So, yeah, here's a tip. If you are going to go to Candle Day, uh, take cash out of how much you want to spend. So pull the cash out, and don't take your debit card or your credit card. Like, especially not your credit card. But uh, then you have to stick to your budget, and you won't go over. I went over by seven candles, and... Sure, Bull's going to be thrilled. Um, mine opened up at 5 in the morning, and it was not as busy in there as I thought it was. There was a lot of cars out in the parking lot, but it didn't seem like that many people inside. It was kind of busy, but not too busy. It, I could see that the candles probably will be sold out, though. Not sold out, but mostly gone. Um, all the good candles, anyways. Probably by 10 in the morning. Like, it's, it's not going to last. People are, con there's more people going and going and going, at least at Alexandria. Hello. He's Will. And, and I'm Jamie. Jamie. <laughs> Welcome to our channel. It's super early in the morning. Yeah, he's grumpy. <laughs> You're grumpy. Um, Today was candle day at Bath and Body Works. Yes, Will slept through it. I yes. got up at... 3.30 in the morning to go to Candle Day because we're an hour and 10 minutes away. Wait a minute. What? Subscribe to our channel. Like this video. Oh, yeah. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> that would be nice. Thank also, you. Also, this is going to be a really long one because it's about candles and, you know, somebody likes candles. I'm just throwing that out there. Yes, I do. So, she woke up super early and drove to Alexandria. Yeah, 3.30 in the morning. I didn't leave until 3.50, though. My son, Brayden, um, decided to go with me. I think I woke him up when I turned on the light because I was Ooh, saw him moving well, around, well. and I'm like, are you awake? And he's like, yeah. I'm like, do you want to go? Yeah. And I'm like, okay. So he just got up, put his shoes on, and got in the car. So I was like, okay. Because he's coming. I needed a little helper, though, so that's great. Will didn't want to go. Um, but, of course, it was that early. So let's get started. I already did a little bit of the video clips of you. I ended up spending way too much. Yes, this, you did. This one's driving me nuts. I like this wig. I like the color, but no, we're not doing a wig video. This is candles in my face. Okay, sorry. Um, new wig. Yeah. Okay, so I had one, two, three, four coupons, and actually five coupons. Um. The first ones I use, you can combine them. If you have mail coupons, they're connected paper ones, you can use them all in one transaction. Um, if they try and argue with you, it states on the back. You can combine all the coupons, so just show them that and 
There you go. Um, mm. So I had the 15 off 40, a purchase of 40 or more coupon. It also would take five off of 20 or um, 10 off of 30, but the best deal is the 15 off of 40. Thank you. <laughs> and then... I had the free gift. If you spend ten dollars, you get a free gift up to thirteen fifty purchase. And okay, the second coupons I got was from a lovely coworker of mine. She didn't need them and just gave them to me yesterday, right before Candle Day. And she had the ten off of thirty coupon. That was it, though. It didn't have the other um thing so it was 10 off of 30 and then a free gift you can get up to 550 free uh we'll be right back okay so we're back um so we're gonna just kind of go in like i said i the first transaction i used the free gift up to 1350 value and the five why are you yelling i don't know um the 15 off of 40 purchase so i got five candles it equaled like i don't know 44 something and then minus the 15 totaled it out to 29.75 before tax not bad for five candles especially since one is like 24 dollars so second transaction i used the free gift 10 off of um 30 and that one totaled out to 25.80 again not bad so that was for four candles and then whatever 37 minus 9 is so that's minus 7 so 28 29 30 31 32 40, 45 6 or 7 yeah 28 candles i got 28 candles i don't even know if i should share this don't don't share <laughs> it was um, well over an authorized dollar amount 248 $200 and 48 cents and the one girl she's like wait wait wait, wait. You said two hundred dollars and forty eight. I wasn't cents? counting the taxes. Mm. But um, yeah, mm. one girl as I was walking out, she's like, "How many candles you get?" And I was like, thirty seven. And she's like, "Whoa, that's a lot." And I'm like, "Yeah, I got a big family." No, damn well, these are all for me. Sorry, family. But we're gonna show you what we got. We got um party dress. Party dress established in twenty thirteen. You wanna smell it? He loves smelling candles. Look how happy he is. It is... I don't know where they tell you about the scents. I have no idea. Oh, soft soft jasmine, orchid petals, and peonies. It does smell like flowers. Like a, like a, uh, like a garden. But not too overbearing, so it's actually pretty good. Yeah. They also gave us... I didn't use this coupon. A little $8 vanilla bean Noel hand or lotion, whatever. They didn't have any, and I don't really care about the... Um, the lotions. lotions and then uh, we got more coupons so I can get a free gift with any $10 purchase up to $16.50 which is really good because a lot of the stuff in their store is like $14.50 to $16.50 and that's why those $13.50 ones are really hard because a lot of things are not under $14.50 um, so I'm really excited about those and we'll be using them Okay, so we decided to do this because as we were sitting down going through all the candles and smelling them, it became a very, very, very long video because we were taking our time. So I figured this would be easier, and i just go through the scents real quick and what I think of them. Um, so, of course, you can see the cellophane wrap. I think it's really pretty. It has that rainbow tint to it. I'm not going to put the candles in it, but... During the semi-annual sale, I do go to Bath and Body Works and get the lotions and sprays and the body wash. That's what I was trying to think of. Um, and I will put those in here, and I use those as gifts because I don't usually use the body care products. This was our free item, and it is originally ten fifty. We were allowed something up to thirteen, uh, yeah, thirteen fifty, and that's the one that. Brayden chose. We have butter rum eggnog. It smells exactly like eggnog. Then we have the cactus blossom. It is a very girly scent. We have marshmallow fireside. It smells like marshmallows. Frozen lake is a, to me like a cologne scent. So the frozen lake and then like winter woods, first frost, uh, fresh sparkling snow out there. 
They're supposed to be winter scents, but those to me can be used all year round. They have a very like, to me, masculine scent. They probably could be used as cologne for men. Uh, moving along, we have maple cinnamon pancakes. I have had that candle before. It smells amazing. It smells exactly like pancakes. Then we have the blue or midnight blue citrus. That one's a new one, and it had sold out online. It is citrusy. I can't really explain the scent, but it is very, very good. The winter candy apple, not one of my favorites, but it is one that Brayden chose, and he really likes, so we got it. Uh, mahogany teakwood high intensity that I've always wanted to get the high intensity one I've only ever had the regular mahogany teakwood I really like it will did not cinnamon pine cone smells exactly like the title it um, is not as strong as the cinnamon pine cones as that you buy from Walmart it's softer frosted cranberry one of my favorites a very strong candle you can like well we light this candle in our living room, and I can smell it in my kitchen, and we do not have an open floor pan, so it's one of my favorites. Winter Woods, uh, Twisted Peppermint. This is a soft peppermint. They had a crushed candy cane, and that one is very strong notes of peppermint. This one has soft notes of peppermint. It's a little bit milder, which I like. Fresh Bamboo is a great candle. It's It's definitely more for spring or summer creamy nutmeg to me that smells like eggnog the toasted vanilla chai i think that one smells like vanilla i don't smell any chai in there the blueberry maple pancakes another one of my favorites forest flurries it smells like cologne to me party dress it smells like it could be perfume or like uh i don't know it's it's definitely girly <laughs> Gelato, smells like ice cream. Uh, Boathouse Row, smells like every typical beach candle that you can get, but I like that, so I got it. London, tea and lemon. I don't really smell any type of tea in there. I smelled lemon and lime. Those are the notes that I got from it. Mineral Springs is a great uh, spring candle, to, in my opinion. Mahogany Teakwood is a great year-round candle. It smells kind of like cologne watermelon lemonade i mean it smells exactly like what it says you get a lot more lemonade scent to it though bergamot water is another one of my favorites and that's a um year round candle flannel it's supposed to be a fall candle but i could probably use it year round winter i probably wouldn't use it in summer but any other season red velvet cupcake Another one that Brayden picked out, I do not typically like it, Spiced Gingerbread Swirl. I didn't really smell any kind of gingerbread in that one. Um, I smelled caramel and a little bit of the spice, like cinnamon or something, but I didn't get any notes of gingerbread. Black Tie, I have that candle. It is wonderful. It's a great year-round candle, and it's it has, um, I don't know, it has more of a... <laughs> I don't know if it smells like cologne or not, but it definitely doesn't smell like oh, flowers or anything like that. Not to me. First Frost, that's a great one. Pineapple Mango, that one was Will's favorite out of the bunch. Vanilla Snowflake smells like vanilla, but a light, you know, it's a light vanilla. It's not too much. Not like the Vanilla Bean Noel. Then Hot Buttered Rum. Ew, that one smells like uh, butterscotch. That, that's what I would say. Eucalyptus mint. I didn't get any notes of eucalyptus in there. I could just be, you know, I smelled too many candles and I'm just not smelling it. But eucalyptus is usually a very powerful scent and I didn't smell it. It smells like mint to me. I still liked it. That's why I got it. Pistachio ice cream. The candle, I'm not too sure if I'm going to like as I smell it more, but... Um, I got it as a wall plug and I really, really enjoyed it. So I'm going to continue... You know, see if I, I like it. Then Cranberry Parabellini is a, that one is like one of my favorites. I'm going to like that one today. And then Fresh Sparkling Snow. That is what we got today. I also got a little hand uh, lotion. Brayden picked it out. It was the sugar cookie one. That was my second free gift, the one that, you know, up to a value of $5.50, and it's originally $4. I hope you like our 
haul and leave us a thumbs up if you did and please subscribe to our channel it means the world to us thank you and we will be back on wednesday <music>